at passengers use of drugs while on board on the priority seats, no less offended many people who were forced to inhale the toxic smoke. He was arrested today, but not for drug use. Bart police have identified the known Bart train meth user, 42 year old Tracy Daniels of Oakland. Officers arrested him on a felony no bail warrant. They found him after getting a call from Oakland resident Ron Thomas. Thomas says he called police after seeing Daniels harass merchants near the Lake Merritt BART station. He had also recognized him from an ABC7 story that reported on Daniels repeatedly smoking meth on the train. It took me further than anything I could think of. Right in front of everybody, the way he was doing it, it was just like, I don't care deal with it type thing. And that's what he is around here. Whatever I do, deal with it. A BART spokesperson told our Vic Lee there was little they could do about Daniels. Either an officer has to witness his drug use or a witness has to report it and be willing to stay until police arrive. Plus, a low-level drug offense is usually only worth the citation. But officers were able to detain him this time because of the warrant out for his arrest. Daniels was wanted for being an accessory to a crime, a felony. No telling how long he'll be in jail. Even so, Thomas says he's happy he's no longer around, at least for the time being. I feel that he needed to go to be evaluated at this point. It seems like he needs to be somewhere where they can really do a real evaluation of what his needs are. News of the arrest drew mixed reactions from passengers, ranging from sympathy for Daniels to relief that they won't have to worry about inhaling his smoke for now. The residue of it, the smell of it, it affects other people. And especially if you have kids traveling on BART, is even worse. This guy needs help, and this shouldn't be happening in public, and he doesn't know any better, obviously. BART police say arrests are up significantly, up 16% from this time last year. They say it's because their officers are more visible and responding more quickly to concerns reported by BART riders.